Hello and welcome to the show. My name is Alex and this is TechFlow. Now, by the time you guys are watching this, I am currently in, or have been to for a month, Australia and New Zealand. Now this is a very overdue video. So many people have requested this and they've said, Alex, what tech do you take with you on your travels? Now, yeah, okay, I'm gonna go through the tech that I take with me on my travels, but bear in mind my current needs. I do daily videos here on YouTube on a vlogging channel, so I need to cater for that. So all the tech I need is based around me daily vlogging and getting my internet needs done and social media and everything. So bear that in mind as we go through everything. But I think I've got a fairly nice setup right here that's pretty cool, pretty solid, and would do for most people. And in some cases, I've even gone to lengths to provide two different options. One a bit more expensive and one a bit cheaper. So, let's do this. So this is my bag right here. This is my go-to bag for everything. And there's numerous reasons as to why it's my go-to bag. The bag itself is customizable, as we'll see a little bit later. It has pockets in it that you can physically customize, take out, put in, shape it to how you want to fit your current devices. It's really, really, really well built. And especially when you're traveling, I hate bags that just have one zip for a compartment. I love to have two zips. Then what I can do is put the zips all the way down to one side and lock them together if I want to, because in airports, things have a tendency to get stolen. It's just a great bag, it looks stylish, it's really, really, really well built. I don't feel bad about overloading this bag and feel like any part of it is going to rip. One of the best bags I've ever used. It's even got a bit here where you can, where you can attach on a tripod um, or, or, or have a drink in here uh, if you'd like and it can just hang down. It's just insanely well built. And it has a compartment for your laptops. So first off, laptops. What's the laptops I'm taking with me when I go away? Here's two options for you guys. So, let's open up the top compartment here. Now this bag comes in three sizes, small, medium and large. This is the medium sized bag, which is good for, I'm gonna say up to a 13 inch laptop. In here, I have a 13 inch Zenbook from ASUS, which is here, absolutely gorgeous laptop with an Intel Core M5 processor in, can run Premiere Pro, uh, absolutely fine, uh, and has a touchscreen, brilliant laptop uh, for under 600 pounds, really recommend it. And here is my Mac of choice, this is the 2014 uh, MacBook 11 inch. Absolutely gorgeous laptop, super light, weight, uh, chuck it in the bag and off you go. Those are the two laptops. One a bit more expensive, one a bit cheaper. You guys can choose what you want. So those are the two laptops of choice. Now, what about tablets? Obviously, I've got my phone in my pocket right here. This is my iPhone with the slip wraps uh, skin on it that they have sent out. I'll drop a link to slip wraps in the description. But that's my phone, that stays in my pocket. It's nothing to do with, with my bag, really. Uh, but in here, let's talk about tablets. So we're gonna open up this compartment here, and as you can see, another reason why I like this bag, places for your passport, pens, anything you want. So up front and centre in this top pocket, I've got my go-to headphones of choice for traveling, the Bose QC25, because they have what's called active noise cancelling. So you put these things on your head, turn on the switch, when you're on your aeroplane or on the bus or on the train, flip that switch, there's no engine noise, no background noise, it's just you and whatever you're listening to. Could not rate these headphones anymore. And even Marcus Brownlee said the same thing. These are a killer pair of headphones. Diving a bit deeper into this top pocket, I have a worldwide adapter here. This is pretty much gonna adapt any plug socket to any plug socket. In the whole entire world, you can't go somewhere and not adapt one type of plug to another. So this is go-to for traveling for me. Wherever I go, I take this and I know I'm always gonna be able to use a power source. Now this is a traveling hack that I've thought of, right? And I'm really proud of this, right? So, so nowadays, when we go on a holiday, we've got so many USB devices. Phones, mi fis cameras, watches. Everything charges via a USB nowadays, right? So instead of taking a load of these and a load of USB cables, scrap that idea, take one of these bad boys. This is an anchor, four port, four port USB hub. So what I can do is plug this into here, there you go, and I've got four USB ports to charge all of my devices. And this one is extra special because it also has a USB-C port on it, which is good for also charging my 2014 MacBook. So think about it, I've used one plug socket, 
and I'm charging four USB devices and my laptop. Travel hacks. So that's that, brilliant, made by Anchor, couldn't recommend it enough. In here I've got an iPad mini with an STM Dux case on it, uh, and I also have uh, an Android uh, tablet uh, here. This is, the reason I've done that is because I know some of you guys prefer Apple and some of you guys prefer Android. There you go. Tablets sorted and stuff. And this is just a USB card reader with a USB-C to USB adapter because my laptop only has one USB port on it. Nice. Switching this bag around in the bottom section, this is where things get a little bit interesting. This is where you can actually customize all of the compartments with the Velcro that they provide. So you can actually customize the sockets and all the, all, the, all, the, all the little sockets and compartments in here. So as you can see, I've got a perfect little socket here or place here in this bag. Fits in nice and snug. The charger for the, um, for the Asus laptop, which fits in, in there perfectly. Down here, we've got some uh, anchor cables. So this is uh, a lightning cable for charging iPhones. And this is a micro USB cable for charging, well, whatever else is in here. Let's find out. So this is a really cool device. Now going back to me at the start saying I do YouTube videos, I need internet to upload those videos. This is a Huawei, whatever you just call it, I don't even know. Huawei, 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 Huawei. Anyway, this has a battery in it. It gives out Wi-Fi and it's unlocked. So wherever you go, if you're traveling to, to, to Europe, travel into America, pick up an American SIM card, pick up a European data SIM card, you put that SIM card in here, it gives off Wi-Fi, wherever you are, you've got fast 3G, 4G, 4G plus Wi-Fi, that's what this device does, it's a portable Wi-Fi device. Really cool. Now these are also insane devices as well, and I've got two of them because I really rate them, two different models. These are two devices, and they're from a company called Hoo Big summer blowout. That's actually an Anchor product, I'll come to that later. Right, this is from Hutu, and it's pretty much a multi-purpose device. It has a USB port on it, so it's a battery bank. That's one purpose for it. Uh, you can plug it in an ethernet cable, so if you're in a hotel uh, and they have ethernet for internet, but they don't have Wi-Fi, you can plug in the ethernet cable into this, and it will give off a Wi-Fi network for you to connect in with your phone. You can also use this thing as a wireless repeater, so it can pick up internet from down the road, or just from outside your hotel room and broadcast it in your hotel room. This is a go-to device for traveling and it's so inexpensive we recommend it to anyone that's going on the travels and needs good internet this is amazing and then in the rest of this bag here we've got an anchor battery back a little small one tiny little baby one 5,000 milliamps there and then we've got a big boy here which this battery bank is amazing because it charges via USB-C so it charges super fast 20,000 milliamps will be good for about seven to eight charges of any phone Really cool. And then another reason why I like this bag is because it has these wicked side pockets on it here, so when you're traveling, you can uh, open that. You've got easy access to your wallet uh, in the side there. And then flick it around on the other side. Uh, I've actually got um, my uh, MX Master mouse in there, which is a brilliant mouse, wireless, and also a pair of Bose in-ear headphones for those convenient times when you don't want to wear some over-here headphones. That whew, is what I take on holiday with me. There you go. Finally made the video. Oh, one more thing. If you're looking for a bit more horsepower, like a bit more horsepower, and you're going away for a longer period of time, this is the biggest laptop, but the beastiest laptop I have ever held and used and seen. Like this is just as powerful, technically speaking, as my desktop computer, right? This, if you're traveling and you're serious about gaming, is a must have. This is immense. Immense. That's going to be it for my travel video. My name's been Alex. You guys have been awesome. This has been Tech Flyer. And we'll catch you in the next one.